we are not doing a good job of looking at the leading indicators, the activity that happens to get them to their quota to see if we're going to hit that number, right? So if you're just starting out, my recommendation would be to find the data that you have today. You don't need a new tool. You don't need to plug in a bunch of stuff right off the bat. Find the data that you have today. So look in your ATS, look in your, in your UCAS system, look at your office suite. The data is there. It's going to take you a little bit of time to, to dig into it and digest it and make the correlations. But you want to find the leading, active, leading indicators activity data so that you can see if Hannah and Brooke are, are, are staffing recruiters on, on my team, I want to see activity for today and this week to see if I think that they're going to be hitting quota at the end of the month or the end of the quarter. Right. And I want to look at that data historically. I want to look at last quarter. Hannah hit 110 percent of, of quota. That's great. Good job, Hannah. Thank you. Uh, but I want to see what activity led to that. So not only can I see what she did to hit 110 percent of quota and use that uh, how I want to use that, but I can track then how she's trending this quarter or how she's trending this month, right? And I can use, if Hannah's my A player on my team, I can use that information and look, compare her to my other team members to see if I see that activity. It's going to take you some time.